Hello everybody, I'm Raphael Perry and I'm back with the boys. No, not the TV series, apparently it exists. I saw a little trailer for it once, uh, but it is on Netflix, which is for rich people and I am very, very humble and poor. So, yeah, we're going to play some more Baldur's Gate 3 Early Access with our party of four druids who have been assaulted by horrific goblin doom divers in the last episode. That poor little gnome is still going round and round on the windmill and someone else can rescue him this time instead of me. <laughs> I love the way that, as you were doing your intro, he said, stop this thing. <laughs> yep. <laughs> And like, boys, it's the gone on cool. for long enough already. I'm getting very dizzy now. Yeah. The Boys is a very, very cool series. Apparently, yeah. Apparently there's some bloke oh, in black with a beard who says something to someone at some point. And then there's somebody called Homelander who does something disgusting with some milk. And then one of the yes. boys is a woman. And she's a villain, but she isn't. And then she is and is someone else, I don't know. See, I know loads about this. It's very, it's, it's very cool, and actually the bloke in black is the chap who plays um, Aemir. Oh, right, okay. In the Lord the of the Rings Aussie film. bloke. Yeah, but the accent's not not really determinable. No, I just mean I his can't accent. remember his I name. I think he's spent Carl a lot of time Irving? in a lot of countries. I think it was Carl it is. Irving, yes. Yeah. And he's, he's obviously spent a lot of time working in a lot of different countries because his accent's really, um, really hard to pinpoint. Or he just spent some time on the oh, international I, I really like dialects him the boys, of actually, he's a really good... the international dialects of English archive, which is yeah. shortened <laughs> to Idea, which is a wonderful website on the internet for looking up Help. if you're wanting to check out foreign accents. <sighs> because uh, all of the accent clips start with the person reading the same piece of set text that everyone else does, and then they talk on a bit about whatever they want, so you can get more of a feel for them in a more relaxed sort of atmosphere. I'll Hello. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Fiji. Help. Udrid seems to be confused about how to stop this thing. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Should I go give him a hand? Absolutely. Uh, go around the back. So the controls for the windmill are inside the windmill. There are two inside levers. Inside the windmill just up a minute ago. There are two big levers. Oh, there's a shield on the ground here. Do we want it? Might come in useful. Yeah, I'm good with that. Stop, it. don't got the ladder. Do you think I just do you think I should smash out the ladder just to get him back? Well not step? while he's on it. So if you look <laughs> to your right. Yeah, not not while he's on it, I'm not that at mean. The the cogs and wheels turning, you see the the two levers by the ropes around the bottom of the barrel like construction with where the quern is turning. Don't Oh god, which one did he click? Left. Did you click release brake or brake? I clicked the left one. Okay. That's the brake lever. Yeah. Good. You didn't kill him. You can literally kill him if you release the brake and it just speeds up until he goes flying off. <laughs> I'm having to photo bomb this exchange of words. Oh no, the, the bear's getting in on the picture. Yeah, man, I want to get my five minutes of fame. <laughs> Cut me loose! Here we go. D this guy really reminds <laughs> me of, of Chris. Oh, bag of Kamara. There's of Chris. pustulant yeah. thugs! Well, get on with it. Ferris. There you go. Polar bear. Hang on, I'm, what? How did I? You you freed him. He selected me yeah, to talk well. to. Oh, that's yeah. uh, that's screenshot worthy for the for the thumbnail for the video. No, no, uh, stay there in the middle of the bear. <laughs> that is screenshot worthy for the thumbnail of the video. Uh. Hang on, did that one take? I'm not sure. Damn it, I'll check quickly. Um, 
Yes, it did. <laughs> okay, people like two and three. Um, I'll go with two for now. You saved me. Now you'll extort me. That's how this works, yes? <laughs> oh God, we're we're jumping into. We are we are not aligned. Evil apparently. territory. Uh, oh, one of everything. Hmm. <laughs> Time to roll a d3. Sure. Oh, Don't know if Michael picked this up, but uh, so that's a one. Yeah, uh, my own fault, really. I should have dropped my pack and outrun those bastards. Alas, take my pack if you can find it. The only reason those goblins caught me was its weight. I'll travel lightly <laughs> from now on. Uh, sure. It's very Ignorance racist, but gone. Alive and well, well, it's it not seems. really. Deep gnomes aren't restricted to the He's underdark, basically you being know. A additional I've lived player. in Baldur's Gate for years, but I still have hope. I'm heading to his home in the Underdark to discover what happened. <clears throat> On that note, <clears throat> I bid thee farewell. If we should meet again, well, we will have Deep met again. Gnome hands are huge. Hmm. Yep, makes yeah. you look like a clown. And his pack is down at, hey, we got a massive pop-up there telling us how many experience points we got, as if it filled in some kind of progress bar. And the cellar down here is where his pack is. I'm in the cellar, man. Y you certainly are, yes. Already trying to loot. I can't, hang on. I can't move this shattered barrel. Can the bear move it? Which one? Uh, this one here. I can click on it, but it won't open, and it's a drag and move it thing. Oh, there's a sack. Empty sack. Okay, I was hoping I you could just it. drag it and reposition it, because I could damage it. Okay, there's literally nothing underneath it okay. to make it worthwhile. Um, well, is is it, somebody's emptied his pack? So unless we find anything <laughs> stuff flying around it. miraculous down here, looks like everything's. That's a lot of cobwebs on the ceiling, mind. Right, I've destroyed that barrel just for just for the fun of it. Okay, I'm going to head outside again. Yeah, there's nothing underneath. That's a bit annoying, isn't it? Okay, uh, moving on. What should I make the video talk of this first one? That bear's got a druid in it. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay, nothing. Uh, early access there. fun. Yeah, I don't remember there being that much here. Do you want a shortcut? Are we going to go and interrupt the uh, the couple? Uh, we, we can literally jump down here and go into the goblin base, but that's kind of dangerous, coming in at that angle. Uh, we, well, we can. I suppose we could call it a rude awakening. Did you want to go camp first? Yeah, I'm down to two yeah, level one do. spell slots. And I need to I need to swap out some second level spells for first level spells, because I... I I've got so many second level spells prepared that I'm not getting use out of them with the current amount of second level spell slots I've got. So... Come here, you. This is the blood smear from the Doom Diver. Yep. Just here. <laughs> so, back to changing spells around a bit. Uh, spike growth, I think I can do without. I'll ditch that and get... Um, Thunderwave back. Okay, steady on. I'm, I'm still rearranging. <laughs> you can still rearrange. Just Hooray, we're back at camp. Anyone wants to uh, I haven't actually used Bob's I don't think anyone yet. does. Um, well, Flaming Sphere is definitely popular. 
Uh, well, hang on. is it? <laughs> it has My been in the of past. Flaming spear so far has been uh, stood there as a bear with it rolling through my body. Um. I wonder what combat whiffs will add to this week's video. Okay, let's let's go very different. Um, is that very good? different? Is fine. Just as or more effective is required. Right. Um, that's two-handed. I don't know. Oh, oh, right. Yeah. Hang on. Um. It was a good idea, and now it's not quite such a good idea. Um, what am I missing? Okay, okay. Because I'm, I'm thinking in terms of being able to swap out weapons in and out of combat, because that, that spear is kind of nice, and because we've loaded a save, we're all holding ranged weapons again. Because I was going to go for like a something else you know that one guy that turns up to the session and uh, needs to do about an hour of housekeeping hey <laughs> no that was a that was an hour Today, and a half and it wasn't me I know exactly who that was he had more teeth than I do more teeth than any adult <laughs> should naturally have Fair enough. No, no literally his nickname was Sharky he had two top rows of teeth at the front Okay, let's let's go rest. I think I've done enough now. Is is everybody else ready? Yeah? Hang on a second. Oh. Okay. So there's a new fan theory about Shadowheart while we wait. Um that I'm I don't entirely disagree with and it ties into some things I've observed in the past, but because you guys haven't necessarily seen it yet, I think, um, I'll hold off. Oh god, are you okay. really trying to rob the skeleton? At least he looks no. a bit more like a skeleton now, instead of, uh, of the weird mummy with... or is it like his, um, his ribs? You, you know, he doesn't have weird skin right. that stops at the bottom of his neck. Are you ready to rest now? Not that I'm in any position to ask that, right? <laughs> you don't sleep yeah. well, flitting oh, between no. dreams and nightmares. No. Why me? Because you're hosting. Shit. Yep. Well, no. E even when, when White Seer was hosting, I was getting these... Just bugger off. No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. I... <laughs> I wasn't going to hurt you. I, I just needed, well, blood. There, in dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire. A slave to sanguine hunger. Okay, look at her, right? Look at that face. Mm -hmm. Look at that hair. What does that say to you? Bring it. She's probably into getting bitten. To me, it says... Medusa. <laughs> Upper class bitch slumming it a bit and not quite pulling it off right. Are you going into full in between this movie mode because she's got that kind of hair? She must have a trust fund. No, I'm thinking of a girl I went to college with. Fair enough. You're right? Okay. Yeah, uh, hmm. Did she, did she Look, have a trust fund? I'm not sure, but her parents did own significant portions of the countryside. Okay. Uh, we rest our case. The um, in between this movie must be gospel. <laughs> I don't even know what it is, but I'm not going to say, I can't believe I didn't notice it when it was that obvious. So, no, look. <laughs> I mean, there was like a an animal sticking its face and its... sticking its ass in its face and everything, but... Nah, uh, okay. I've never killed anyone. Well... Not the food. I 
feed on animals, bulls, deer, kobolds, whatever I can get. But it's not enough. Not if I have to fight. I feel so weak. A strange what, sensation a courses through you. And your companion's four of us. mind unfolds. We don't need you. Secrets half revealed. I still want to try out the uh, that bug I had before where I had a Beastmaster Ranger who attacked my pet as soon as I returned to camp. Mm. He died because it was just stupid. He literally attacked the whole party. Next patch. Huh? my camp. <laughs> oh, I... Yeah, if you... If you tell the monster hunter who's looking for him about it, then he can turn on you. Because he knows he's been betrayed. It might have been something to do with no, that. No, it wasn't even that. It was like... No, I hadn't even met that guy. I literally just... I've done about one quest, maybe the cathedral. Oh. Went back to the camp before I did the god and jumped me. Hmm. So, I, I will go for option three because mm. we're trying to push for strange powers this time, aren't we? And for more dreams. Yeah, why not? Auto roll. Needed a one, got a two. I, I'm not seeing your dice roll on this. Did everybody else get it? No. Interesting, okay. there's no voiceover for that line either. Hmm. And it's stuck. I. What's this? What's happening? She's been taking a. Uh... A leaf out of that acolyte's book. <laughs> like, she can't look straight on. <laughs> to be fair, he is standing over her. Yeah, yeah. But she should angle. If she's going to tilt her head back to look up, she shouldn't angle her neck forward so much, or she'll get a really stiff neck. Uh, it's absolutely stuck. I can't progress this. Mhm. Mm Wonderful. Uh, I don't know what okay. to do. Ah! Yeah, a shadow swims across your vision and a familiar voice tells you to Isn't be calm. You, open your you mouth are loved. And bite down. Not into a tender neck, but into the twisting body of a rat. The only thing your master lets you eat. Yeah, that, that's not love, that's abuse. Yeah. Um, I don't want to let him know that I've just seen into his mind because that might, he might get feelings of invasion of privacy. So I'm going for second option because that's stating the bleeding Um, obvious. the guy was in me for quite some time in episode one. <laughs> yes, I know. Sure which, which is why I'm feeling awkward that he's warriors. now picking on me. It's like you're yeah. the one he was obsessed with. I needed you to trust He really wanted to get some wood and he and didn't. Maybe Trust that's why he's changed his mind. <laughs> um. Because we don't have a choice. Not if we're going to save ourselves from these worms. I need you alive. You Tempo. need me strong. Please. Only be a taste. I hate well. his backwards belt buckle that I'll can't be well, work. You'll be fine. It pisses me off all the and time. And everything can go back to normal. I hate the fact that we need him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Really? I... Of course. Not one drop more. So it's two clicks, not three, right? He holds you Unless carefully. Unless we really want to go overkill. Delicately. Until he strikes. If you uh, let him go all the way, he'll, he'll kill you. It's like a sharp yeah, that's free click into seven. your neck. <laughs> a quick, sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness. Your breath catches. Your there's, pulse quickens. There's two chances to pull out. Um. <laughs> that's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> said the actress to a bishop. Okay, that's a fairly easy roll. He says, rolling a free. Um, uh -oh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it because I believe there's a second chance. You lean into him, losing yourself. You can feel your blood racing, coursing through both your bodies. 
a gentle, numb feeling starts to spread. Now this is where I I'm, blow a reroll back out to. There. Okay, I think it's reroll time now. Uh, I'm not going to blow our second reroll on that because it's the last one we've got. You can hear how weak your voice is. So can he. But he doesn't care. He's long past caring. You feel a little cold, but that's all. There's no more pain, no more fear, no more struggle. Alright, you get to be rezzed. It's all over. Oh, wow. They're very nihilistic in the in the tone of this narration, aren't they? Oh, no. We're all just having a rest something and we wake up to that. <laughs> wow, it's worse than the thing. Just say something terrible yeah. has happened. You, you know what's walks. really annoying? You, you can't... You might not be able to take the amulet to speak from dead from my body to ask me what happened. <laughs> <laughs> Although you can pretend you oh, can. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Look at the state of your bed. Yeah, he went to town on you. That's a really bad period right there. Oh, dude. <laughs> we didn't have to go that far. <laughs> oh, I didn't even get a rest out of it either. Man, the, the, the Jolly Rancher in your pocket melted over time. Did you not get your spells back? No, when, when, when you die that way, you don't get a rest. So we rest again. Nothing comes back, so yeah. I'm gonna have a word with you, Mr. You're, Bitey. You're here. Thank goodness. I was worried about you. I, I don't. A little ill last I don't night, believe he was worried because his lips weren't recovered. moving when he said it. <laughs> mm. <laughs> wow. Ill, you killed me. Actually, no. Punch uh, him. Killed feels like a strong word. Not many corpses have your vigor. Now, I admit, I got carried away last night. I apologize. But look at you now, perfectly healthy. So let's not fall out over this. We still need each other, after all. So I think they really need to work on the female gauntlet models because the male ones have got lots of detail and are interesting and the female ones are really bland and flat, especially the leather ones, which are just like almost a retexture of the plate ones. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A strong, well-fed vampire? I'm a powerful weapon. You'd be a fool to toss me aside now. Anyway, last night was an aberration. It will never happen again. Do we need this guy alive? What do you say? Can we let I'm not particularly sure. No innocents. You have my no word. Innocence. Only villains that we need to kill anyway. <laughs> After all, you know what I am now. I can fight with all my weapons. Teeth included. And if I happen to drain the occasional bandit during a fight, what's the harm? They're just as dead. Well, will they get up as a vampire to come follow us? Or what, you know? It's not good. Uh, hmm. three. I'm not going to make him feed on animals. That's go on roll. I bet you get a four. Uh, uh, you know, the more druidic approach would be all life is equal. You know. Hmm. Yeah, just punch him. This is something I should ask about. It's simple. Just find a vampire that will drink your blood and turn you into a vampire spawn. They're obedient puppet. In theory, the next step is to drink their blood. Once you've done that, you're free. And a true vampire. 
People think the biggest threat to a vampire is a cleric with a stake. It's not. The biggest threat to a vampire is another vampire. They're scheming, paranoid, power-hungry beasts. So why would any vampire give up control over a spawn to create a competitor? Trust me, it doesn't happen. But then, if he's a vampire spawn, surely that means as much as a duck. that means he's obedient to the vampire that created him. So somehow he's regained some mm -hmm. kind of independence, possibly by being captured by the mind flayers. I don't know, but there's some interesting thought there Maybe. to look at later on. Right, let's let's try and get some actual recovery and I'm gonna go for a different bed this time I don't want that horrific reminder who's in it oh <laughs> we'll find out in a moment oh I uh, didn't even get to rest hmm? what happened I'll try again uh, I'm not in it oh for God's you are sake. in your own bed there you go <laughs> Oh, that's a lot of in and out of cutscenes. Yeah, it must have remembered. All right, we okay. are all back here. Back the table. Um. Okay, that is one thought. Uh, oh, both these spells are concentration required. That's really annoying. Lots of druid spells are. Just yeah, but it means I mind. can't have. Here's the shit stain. Oh, here's the muddy puddle. The shit puddle. Yeah. Let's see if we can kill her in the same spot. Uh oh. Why are you going right, up I'll there? Right, I'll open the door then, shall I? Mm, yeah. Why are you headed up here, friend? What have you found? Oh, oh there's a camp up there, isn't there? With a few little yeah. food bits and bobs. Ah. Uh, Rotten basket is completely empty. Right, I'm going to open this door. Okay, hold on. I'm just going to see if I can get on the roof. Well, someone else has managed it. Climb. Is that Climb so that you can those. better direct? Climb up the tiered uh, area that we can. Yeah, we climbed up the rocks this side and then jumped over. Yeah, I was just seeing if I can get That was a good idea. Created a little bit of a barricade. All right, let's open the doors. Oh, it's gonna be a disaster. Okay, over it. You are unable to speak. Ah, oh, I get no cutscene. See, normally it defaults to another party member by that point. Oh, that's annoying. But okay. Oh, anyway, okay, mate, I've got a barricade, and I don't want to have a rock thrown at me like you did last time. <laughs> She's going to try the rock on me now. What's the range? The range is... Yeah, but you've dodged it. Ah, oh, it's a touch spell. This guy's stuck behind a barrel. Oh. Probably not for long. Okay, I have a plan. It's all good. Um, I'm going to see you. Um, oh, is this dumb? This is dumb. No, it's not that dumb. Well, if it pulled him up onto the roof of me, it would have been. Kinda needing her to That's come outside. Throwing. Threw on me. Oh, they just walked straight over that little barricade. Yep. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. I'm guessing that was a little bit underwhelming range-wise. Yeah. Well, if you could 
thunder wave her back into it. Of course, there's certain verbal and somatic restrictions to that. Okay. I'll stay here and get ready to get my kicking. Yeah, I was going to cast bark oh, skin on you, but you were too far away. <laughs> I've got bark skin. Cool, I'm going to do I something. Cast, I cast it on me. Are you moonbeaming? Well, not you are. Good, 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 good. It's like totally off centre. For that move. Yeah. Hold on. I think it's the target the floor thing. This absolutely is a target for the monster. Supposed to uh, target the monster. Okay, so I haven't managed to stick her in the moonbeam, but I tried. I'm gonna get um clobbered in about three seconds. It's what the? There we go. Yeah. Now I can die as well. Wasn't far wrong, was I? Oh, 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 oh. shit. Kept you alive, though. 20 hit points. I didn't need you to, man. I got bark skin and I got 30 hit points. Yeah, but I wasn't expecting her to walk right over there and mull me. Did <laughs> okay. she just throw a barrel of water at her? Yep. That means she's probably got a lightning spell ready or something. I am messed up. I know what I was going to do. Oh, oh I'm man. I'm trying to heal you. I can't... I can't do the thing I was going to do. Dude, now. I thought you were going to finish your walk. No, no. I'm going to just do this. Crit this woman. That guy will come running over in a second anyway. Just make sure you're out of his range. Yeah, but now I need to move the moonbeam, which is an action. Rather than the bonus action for some reason. So okay. I can't hear it at the same time. He'll walk straight through that anyway. And he's enveloped. Take you. I thought it best just to get into the combat with uh, Big Bertha, or whatever her name is. Bathir. Okay, I've presented her a bit of a movement difficulty there. I should get an attack of opportunity on her, right? If she moves. If uh, she goes after Ren. That's right, she takes so. <laughs> She takes less damage against Flame, by the way, because she's wet. Oh, lovely. Thanks, me, buddy. <laughs> that's what you did. Yeah. That probably wouldn't apply to the bugbear, though, right? The bugbear's not wet. Not yet. Uh, it seems to be raining. I'll just smash this. <laughs> oh, I but the extreme overkill more. excessive targeting is. Being what it usually does. Extextura. Uh oh. It's another pounce. It's another pounce. Okay. Oh, I didn't get him goaded. Wow, you just went straight through that wooden post. Yeah, sticking up my leg. That's not a leg. <laughs> okay. <laughs> night, night. <laughs> yep. I goaded him, so he had I to kind of know him. how he feels. Uh, yeah. Oh, I've got to end my turn. Well, you get a partial turn if um, Fuji reses you, brings you back. 
Could be working on it. Oh, that's not good. Who's birth here? Oh, it's her. Cheers. So, I'm wondering then for if that's like a prototype barbarian class ability when we get a barbarian character class, if it will have our character name on the ability on mouse over on the, like the status icon so that we're not affected by other people's or something like that. They might have to do something similar with smites mm. as well. And, oh yeah, I was, I was saying to a couple of you during the week um, about the, my idea that the tag system they use for conversations, they're probably using that for things like Ranger's Favourite Enemy as well, because it saves having to create another system to do it. It's like, I know when they were working on the Divinity mm -hmm. Original Sin games, they made a big point of being like, hey, look, here's this tag thing, and we use the tags in conversations, so when you see an option come up in conversation, you'll know it's a tag you've got um, and you know what tags you've got in your character sheet in advance and I was, I was just thinking like last week or week before hey they could they should probably use these for out of conversation stuff as well and I'm sure they've already thought of that mm -hmm. ages ago but it's the idea just kind of I like the idea of that being done that way right mm -hmm. so now that I'm actually up and wait 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 stop wait don't do it do what? So now that I've given everyone advantage on attack rolls against the ogre, you should have really waited to attack until after I've done that. What did it move to him? I suppose it would help for like attacks of opportunity and stuff now, though. Now you've jumped away, so there won't be one. Oh, you're trying to get her to run through. Oh, yeah, but the flaming door. spear can now go in there. And the moon will hit again. It doesn't need yeah, to, apparently. <laughs> I'm going to click that short rest button now because it hurts a lot. Oh, we've got chance. Yeah. Never thought I'd ever walk in on a bugbear and an ogre. Um. Don't! The flaming sphere rolls oh, right God. through the middle of it. Ah. <laughs> uh. Um. Uh. Well, it's too. So many approval disapproval notices. So I'm gonna do this now. Yeah, please don't. Wait, what? You ran into your own moon. Why did I get help? Why would I? Why would it hurt me? I, I don't know, but there's there's two differences from how it normally works in fifth edition that people have been grumbling about in the forums that may or may not get patched at some point in the future, and I think that might be one of them. Oh, there's a great sword in here. It's probably not that great. What I'm actually looking for is a uh, there's a leather helmet there. Yoink. Oh, the one with the plus one to reflex saves on it, right? Or or plus one d4 or something. There's I, that is a weird thing about fifth edition that like plus a d4 to this attack roll. It's like the, the non-static bonuses, the the randomly rolled bonuses. You know, that's a little odd. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've seen it before in things like Stormbringer, but but not in d20 to to actual d20 rolls to, to things like damage and stuff yeah sure yeah yeah to result rolls but not to trying, doing something rolls. what i'm trying to find is a um it's a sledgehammer uh-huh because the one down in the cellar was before, right? so hard to find it wasn't there anymore was it they, they got rid of the one in the cellar 
They got rid yeah. of a load of weapons from the, the forge in the cellar, actually. Yeah. I mean, Shall we make our way into the main goblin camp to the priesthood? Um, I'm on about half spell slots again, so I just have to be careful. Yeah, we can take it slow, encounter by encounter. Yeah. So, we're going to face the goblins now. Yeah, why not? Or do you want to do face spiders? Um, this spear would theoretically be good against face spiders, but... I'm happy to do either. So let's do space fighters then, since they're here. And then move on okay. to the goblins. Yeah, so the well. they must want us all to go down the well, because the, the usual alley has been Apart from an overgrowth of moss, the well looks unremarkable. I believe in you. Hey! I mean, there's got to be some come up for those duff rolls Dry right stones line the wall. At the mm. bottom, something gleams in the dappled light. <laughs> We've got Idrid in the background throwing trash out onto the floor. Careful. Those webs carry vibrations. Oh, now she's like black with cool. shoulder plates. <laughs> it's the, the feathery stuff around it. Well, we're having that. Oh. Study shoot. Uh. Something didn't like that. We're waiting on our fourth party member, aren't we? Hold on. Oh wait, now this spider silk yeah. cocoon is stealing. That's new. Mm. From them, mm. He's not coming down. What's going on? We're under attack, and that was a 20 point non critical hit. Oh, mate, I can't heal you at this distance. No, no, I cannot select. I cannot select it. Uh, the uh, bucket really? in the well. Yeah, we're getting trashed. Uh, not can do the help. Okay, that is bizarre. Could it be because you guys are in a fight? Um, possibly, but <sighs> probably not. There's probably another reason. There's another way in. There. Are you an animal? No, you're not. Okay. No. Yeah, there, there is another way in. It involves. Breaking down the wall in the forge with the sledgehammer, which we don't have. Oh, it's just. When was the last save game? Um, start of the session. So nearly an hour ago. I'm, I'm getting close enough to heal, but not quite yet. Then again... Oh, bloody hell! Well, I don't need to get closer to heal now. Yeah. In fact, I... I'm not going to be able to at all. Mate, you might have to drop back. Um... For... Like, seriously. Uh... Get get one of us up so we can heal the other one. I think we should load it. Yo, if Edred can't get in it. We're just getting one shot by all these space spiders. Yeah. Okay, but you brought this on yourselves. Get 
I did warn you all. Well, rap, we're half dead. The game is going to finish your balls no, anyway. I fully understand. I'm, I'm just... I'm, I'm padding while the load bar takes an incredibly long time, okay? <laughs> That's what I'm doing. It's about two-thirds now. Yeah, at the usual hanging point. So, we know some things to do and some things to not do. Um, I'm finding the Druid class to be somewhat powerful, but very squishy at the moment. Yeah. I think the best thing to do maybe in that fight is to not be in animal form and have four flaming spheres out. Just... Uh -huh. Yeah. Be a spider. Just light them up. Actually, yeah, you can actually cast Flaming Sphere and be in bear form. Because you can still basically concentrate on your spells. Well, you can. Okay. So I'm going to go change spell slots. There we go. I still don't like the fact we can change spell slots without resting and it actually changes the spells we have available to cast because they either couldn't work out to keep it separate or, or didn't want to. That feels mm. like the kind of 5th edition thing that I don't like so much. Right, I'll go pull this lever again to keep things simple. I've done the lever. Oh, I've done it again, Ben. I've done the case. lever. I'm looting the thing. Come on, untie me! <sighs> so, like like the windmill itself, things have come full circle. <laughs> Thought I'd come up with another nice yeah. druidic analogy there. Ugh. Bag of Kamara. Kind of and he's still as you know. Who's he talking thugs. to this time? Well, oh, for get on with sake. it. Hello. Uh, hello. Hi, yeah. How you doing, man? Haven't talked to you in a while. Okay. Yeah, it's just, uh, my new machine's arrived, but unfortunately, uh, it's only got one USB port, so I either plug the lights in or okay. I plug the headphones in. That's good to know, but I should warn you, we're currently recording, so. You're going to be on YouTube, man. Oh. <laughs> uh, Hope you're okay with that. Play... Yeah, just sort of, yeah. Uh, how's Baldur's Gate going, anyway? Um, oh, we, we just played for nearly an hour and got into an awkward situation where one of us couldn't use an area transition, and so we were split up in a fight. It got nasty, and we had to reload, and I hadn't saved recently. Okay, so you're playing the game with these other guys, are you? Never... Yeah, we're, we're playing an all druid party just to be enjoy the new class. Okay, I, 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 I obviously have Baldur's Get through myself, but uh, I've been on the wild. I wouldn't mind knowing that you're playing playtesting like that. Uh, anyway, yeah, that's alright. No ne next time we start a playthrough, maybe you can sit in and, and play as well. Yeah. Yeah, I might actually have uh, uh, Steam working by then, but yeah. Oh, I'm let's hope yet. so. I've got, yeah, I've got, uh, got uh, my notebook running at the moment, uh, but uh, my, uh, so I'm going to get uh, Oblivion and uh, Skyrim loaded when I can. Stephen was around here yesterday, he's talking about those games, so the, mm. hey, I might have to play that. Anyway, Good man. So uh, let, you get back, let you get on with your, your play test, but I have a machine available, and yes, I have to use the uh, keypad and I uh, can't use a, uh, a mouse uh, properly, you have to use the uh, laptop type mouse. So Ooh, apart okay. from that, yeah. Well, yeah, it, uh, yes, otherwise it's perfectly okay. Yeah, hopefully that means I'll see you tomorrow for Shattered Star and there'll be a lot less technical issues in the last couple of weeks. Obviously, yes, 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 absolutely. So uh, see you again and uh, yep. see you tomorrow. All right, lovely. Bye. Yay, got you there. So we were just gate crashed by Paul. He's about 20 years older than I am. <laughs> it's humorous how my character leans out. 
every now and then, like he's bored. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He, he's like, hey, I'm here too. I just want to yeah. like, let's be part of the conversation, let's, man. Uh, let, let's uh, crack on with the conversation. You saved yeah. me. Get back with now to where you'll we were. extort me. That's how well, this works. Well, what we'll yes? do after this conversation, I think, is we'll you know, go down to the cellar, grab his pack, and I'll save the game just so we don't have to redo this oh. again. I've, I've grabbed his pack. Uh, my own fault, oh, okay. really. I should have dropped my pack and outrun those bastards. Alas. What Take you need my to do is if you can find it. rest. The only yeah. reason this do your spell plots again. Wait. I, I, save I'll the game. those around already. From now on. And I think quick save after Ignorance every fight. Ignorance is alive and well, it seems. Deep gnomes aren't restricted oh, no, to the save. Underdark, you know. Hey, hey I, I showed you that video about the overuse of I'm in search saving. of a friend. <laughs> I fear he's in trouble. Yeah. See this? That was brilliant. I gave it to him years ago before I left home. But I still have Skip hope. to the end. I'm heading to his home in the Underdark to discover what happened. I, I don't know which button I does always that. help my space friends. Bar, space bar. Yeah, but I know that I know that pressing a space bar also selects a random dialogue option from the next one. So for so it's not a preferred option. Right, where the hell are you guys going? I thought we were going back to camp. Yeah, but I'm making using the time waiting for you to get ready to walk over here to the ship brown stain I'm ready. on the floor. I've already, and then I'm ready. I've already changed my spell slots prior to I mean, uh, the, the gnome. Then. Right, awesome, let's go to camp. Not Yeah. No camp out. That's not camp, that's the fast travel button. There we go. Sounds like someone was suffering there. All right. Yes, I don't know what that was. Let's click a bedroll. You don't sleep well. Maybe you wake up because you know something is wrong. Just punching this time. Shit. <laughs> Shit. No, I don't think she's going to quite do that. No, no, it's not what it looks she's like. She's got a trust fund, I remember. I... <laughs> there, in dim yeah. firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire. So she's got manners. A slave to sanguine yeah. hunger. Then again, remembering back to college. Mm. She's very I've never killed anyone. Well, not for food. I feed on animals. It's not enough. Not if I have to fight. If I just have a little blood. A strange sensation courses through you. And your companion's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. So let's see if this goes buggy again. It's interesting we're not seeing dice rolls this time. I wonder if it's because we have the loaded dice turned off. I saw your investigation roll on the well, just not this one. Interesting. I think it's because... Technically speaking, we're not listening in. We're forced to watch this. Or because this one doesn't use a stab. You open your mouth and bite down. Not into a tender neck, but into the twisting body of a rat. The only thing you'll mind. <laughs> At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. Mm. No. I needed you to trust me. And you can. Trust me. Well, at least he understands that ribs get in the way. Um. Because we don't have a choice. Not if we're going to save ourselves from these worms. Please. I'm going to go one in, but I'll use a reroll on the first one if I have to. I'll be well, you'll be fine. And everything can go back to normal. He holds you carefully. Delicately. This static campsite feels strikes. very Dragon Age Origins, doesn't it? It's like a shard of ice into your neck. Especially the muddy bits. It feels like we didn't even bother looking for anywhere better, to be honest. Numbness. It's always the your same place. Even if we're quickens. in the Underdark. Phew. Alright. Well, I can't feel this one again. Oh, you That's can. Correct. <laughs> Oh, of course. 
Right, now can I get some sleep? My mind is finally clear. I feel strong. Okay. I feel... Va the, the blood dribble from his mouth is now completely gone. It would have been good if it was still there at this point. It would have made more sense. Mm -hmm. Right, yeah, look. I want to go sleep now. I'm feeling very tired and drained and just need a rest. Ah, don't be so dramatic. This is just a little See, it's back now. between friends. And look what you've I done. I think it was there. It's just Together, dark. We it just wasn't the there in the close-up. Yeah, look, um, I just want to go slow. Shouldn't take long. So many people need killing. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, you're invigorating, but I need something more filling. You watch as he stalks towards the forest. Stronger, more confident, ready to hunt. All right. Go find yourself a squirrel. Right. Now I save. Yep. That's better. Might as well restart the recording then. It seems like a good time. Back in a bit. <laughs>